Are you happy that your grandson found a pretty wife? Who wouldn't be? Oh, yeah. I often thought about finding girls for him, but he didn't need to do anything for him because he did it on his own. <laughs> oh, pop off the pill. Oh, pop off the like, hey, look, Brandon, I could have hooked him up, you know. I got him lined up. I'm so proud he finally did something on his own. <laughs> what a sweet old man. He's like, oh, yeah, he finally, oh. <laughs> Brandon. I'm gonna hook him up, you know. <laughs> Went and found him a real keeper. Hello, everybody. Welcome back. I'm Ken. This is Buff Pro, and we're watching more 90 Day Fiance with Brandon and Julia. The saga continues. Last time, Brandon was pretty much the worst human being on the whole planet. <laughs> this time, probably much probably the, the worst human being on the planet. <laughs> <laughs> but we're back on the we're back with the table. Hooray! Uh, if you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button. Do all that kind of cool stuff. It helps out a lot. You can check out uh, the gaming channel, Toasty Games. We play video games there. You can check out uh, Buff stuff at uh, Buff Pro on Twitch, uh, Buff Pro The on YouTube. Yeah. Yeah, Buff Pro is taken by some buffer company. Something. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> really? Yeah. Yeah, it is. <laughs> they got like two videos, and, and but they, they snagged it. Okay, here's Scott's stuff too. He edits the videos. Yay. Boy, well, you getting off close to my ear. I am. Uh... scaring me to death. Uh oh. It's uh -oh. okay. You got two of them. <laughs> <laughs> All right, <laughs> getting his haircut. Mom, mom, cutting old dad's hair. Give him that Trunks haircut from Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like she's literally just cutting his ears out of the haircut here. <laughs> Wait, what is? What do they got on the? I see like the big old shears right here, but then they got like some. <laughs> what is that? They got clear coat of. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> she's spray painting that junk white. Is what she did. <laughs> <laughs> I'm scared. Look at this side first. Which, don't tell me one side. On <laughs> she is cutting his ears out. <laughs> <laughs> and she also like grabs him by the nose. Too, like, Look at this side. Yeah. Like, Turn your head. This is called the quarantine special. <laughs> oh man, I've had some of those haircuts, you know. Yeah. I had, yeah. I just had the Jesus hair. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't cut it for a long time. I had the quarantine haircut. Like just Mary, I just let her shave like the sides of my head, and like I had. Mullet? A mullet, yeah. <laughs> I basically had like a mullet going on, and I kind of wish I kept it now. I wish I had grown the mullet out and had like a mustache. Oh, you know? wow. yes. Yeah. That would be great. That I told, would be great. I told Mary, I was like, hey, you care if I just grow a mullet out? And she was like, do it. I was like, oh. <laughs> so That's how you know you found the one. <laughs> so keep watching, and maybe in like six months, I'm going to have a mullet. Yeah. Uh, Ken, if you're listening, please do that haircut. Just need it. Just once. <laughs> I just grown the mole out and had like a mustache. Oh, oh yes. Yeah. You just spell your name out on the side of your head too. Kid. <laughs> a little toast on this side. Yeah, a little toast. My mom has exceptional hair cutting skills on dogs. Brandon, don't act like your mom didn't give you that haircut. That's right. right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she did. Of course she did. He's got that look on his face like, mom, mom's going to do me next. And what we, you think he's like, Maybe that's like a slight as dad. Like she does a good job at cutting hair on dogs. <laughs> dad. <laughs> he just told off on his dad. His dad is a dog. <laughs> He's a dog. <laughs> you got the coronavirus. You've got the immigration stuff. What's your game plan? What is, have you guys sat down and discussed? A little bit. Yeah. 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 Wait, wait, we're supposed to do stuff after we get married? What do you mean? <laughs> <laughs> wow. You know, this is the rest of your life. You should be happy and you just don't appear to be. That bothers me a little bit. He's making a big step, both of them. Yeah, 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 Dad, yeah. You should be happy, but you don't seem to be. You literally had your fiance cry in the church because you didn't seem to be happy. <laughs> yeah. Or even care a little. It kind of bothers everybody, right? <laughs> They've got to figure this out, and they don't have a lot of time to do it. That's not the haircut she gave him. <laughs> nope. She didn't give him that haircut. <laughs> nope. <laughs> It might seem like we are kind of uh, rushing into this, uh -huh. and we are. Right. Yeah, yeah the, the show's called 90 Day Fiance, bro. <laughs> it's the show you signed up for. Yeah. Bro. 90 days, you know? I'm sure if you knew this, but uh, that's about three months, Brandon. <laughs> do I go ahead and go through with this marriage, or do I just say goodbye to her forever? You can't sustain. Why are, they, why are those the only why? two options? Yeah, what? How about a normal relationship and it takes time and then, you know, eventually you figure it out. 
What an ultimatum. Either we I marry her or I get rid of her. Right now. That's it. <laughs> Dude, he is the worst. He's still the worst. It's different when it was just on his phone and she sent him nudes. He's like, oh yeah, girl. That's <laughs> anyway. Yeah. <laughs> now, then he puts his phone away and she goes away. Yeah. And <laughs> now she's here and he's like, now she's here. either I marry her or get rid of her. That's it. It's either we do this or we give up on our relationship. I I'm not ready to give up on this relationship. Okay. Well, that's what we want to hear. You truly Thanks, Brandon. All right. That's all you have oh, to say. Oh, you do care. Wow. Oh, wow. Okay. Wow. Oh. Signs of life. You truly love her. Yeah, I love her. When Julie and I aren't arguing or she's not angry at me, we have so much fun. And <laughs> Look, she's not talking to me. And you know, as long as she's not doing all of her Julia stuff, you know, <laughs> we get along, you know. It's always her fault, man. All right, it is. 90 days is a short amount of time to try and figure out if you want to marry someone. And now with coronavirus. Brandon, you're just running your gums. I'm pretty sure your very first message to her is like, you look like my new wife. I'm pretty sure it took you like five <laughs> seconds of being thirsty and looking at your camera or your picture on your phone to decide you wanted to marry her. I feel like uh, I'm rushing into things with this, but don't feel like I was really given a, a, a choice. That poor man. Julia forced his entire marriage on this poor, innocent man who asked her to uproot her entire life. If, if you were just like watching this show, that could be like a very passive thing that you may not even think twice about. When you really think about what he's saying, <laughs> it's really messed up. It is. It is. It's pretty bad. I feel like I don't have a choice. You know, TLC came to me and said, hey, do you want to be on Night Day Fiance? And you read a contract and signed it, you know. <laughs> yeah, you just didn't have a choice to do that, did you? You know, you could have just like extended your relationship and I don't, what do you mean you don't have a choice? Uh, what? <laughs> I hope Julia sees all these. <laughs> I hope Julia really sees all these and she's like, God. what? You don't, you didn't have a choice? Yeah, okay, yeah, this number one comment right here, I didn't have to say it. I'm, it always surprised me how these people sign up for 90 days and then act shocked that the process is rushed. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm so glad that I can say this stuff and then read the comments. And they're just like, they reinforce it, you know? The, uh, the next clip is called, Julia doubts Brandon cares about the wedding. Whoa! What? No! Whoa! Whoa! Understatement. I feel like if we're going to do that later, I don't. Why is Bob in there too? <laughs> oh my God. Well, let's try and make it as we special as We just want to get it can. out of the way and then go do a big That's thing. Sad. No, Brandon, this is uh, silly. Be serious. I don't know the context of everything they're talking about right now, but he basically just said, get their wedding out of the way. Yep. You know, I mean, if we're going to do, you know, the whole living together thing and family stuff, you know, we might as well get this garbage out of the way. You know what I mean? It's really bugging me. Like she's just like, what did you what did you say to me? And even mom's like, that's sad. Big that's thing. sad. She didn't just like get up and like slap the crap at him like she should. She's like, oh Brandon, that's so mean. <laughs> get her, Brandon. You tell her. Yeah. If you're not serious, think about Mary Baby Mary. I think I'm gonna go into the kitchen and finish up those dishes. Yeah. Love you guys. Yeah. yeah. Love you. <laughs> Don't worry about these, leave these cameras in here, but I'm going to get out of here yeah. because uh, they're going to interview him after they have this conversation be like, Julia just, it's all her fault. <laughs> <laughs> if she wasn't rushing me and bullying me into this marriage, I wouldn't have done it. <laughs> start uh, plans, you not care. When we start church, church, you not care. When we start church, uh, church, you not care. You don't care about nothing. I care about you. Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. What you care about me exactly? Like, does he? Does he? She laid it out, man. She's like, you don't care about anything. They put the, the coronavirus. That's... <laughs> oh, we'll just call the CDC and call off the whole coronavirus. <laughs> <laughs> like, no, really, dude? There's, no, there's only one virus that's the issue right here. It's, <laughs> it's you. It's Brandon. It's you, bro. Sure. It's your freaking attitude, man. Hey, what do you care about me? What do you do for me? Maybe you need to ask your mother what you do for me? <laughs> I, I know you see Maybe all the you... negative, but you never see any of the positive. Julia, it's all your fault. Yeah, Julia, I do so much. You just, you're asleep when I do it. But you just keep looking at the negative because it's just me and you keep looking at me. <laughs> so it's really hard to see any of the positive. I know it's, it's weird, right? Wow, that gosh darn coronavirus. Dang it. 
He would hit you at the stop sign and get out and be like, why'd you stop? Yeah, what was what up, man? What are you doing? This is your fault. <laughs> God, coronavirus made you stop, I guess. Man. I just think it's you. Why I, I don't know. If you don't, but you don't, 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 don't. Come on, he's waiting. Oh, man. Oh, oh man. Oh, the situation that made for myself is so stressful. If I could just take, I don't know, two seconds to see how many of my spills aside for myself. Oh. <laughs> I can't with this guy, man. She finally said what he's been waiting for her to say. Why don't we just not have the wedding? He's like, oh yeah, why don't we just not have it then? <laughs> oh, well, I mean, you know what? Julia doesn't want to have the wedding. We're done. My mother and Julia want to make this more special. And I want to save all that for the big day when we actually have a real ceremony for when we actually have a special day. He's got so many reasons, right? He's, he's got as many reasons as he has protein shakers on his <laughs> camera back there. He's like the most protein skinny dude I've ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> They're just craps, pure protein powder. <laughs> protein bricks. So I, I guess they're having a ceremony here, but then they're going to have a bigger one at some other point. So he's like, okay, well, we'll just kind of eh, this one and then have a bigger one later. It's not just the ceremony. It's the, the whole part of you getting married. Married. That's important. You know, that's there's kind of an important thing that's still happening there that you got to be a little excited about. It's like, but we're, but we're just, this is this is the, kind of the practice one, you know, I guess. This is, this is the one where we just sign the document. Can we just do this at the courthouse? Like, I don't understand why you care so much. Julia, go back. I not believe we have big waiting later. I don't believe we have money for waiting day. So I want this is the day special. Like I want to be princess for this day. And like he'll say, oh, you're so beautiful. How I lucky with you. I want this. I want feeling like this. He don't care about this. He just want marry, resigned. Okay, thank you so much. We go home. Take care, animals. <laughs> She's not wrong. <laughs> Ah, yeah, yeah, it was great. It was great. Yeah, get, get back out there. She's like the most normal person I've ever seen on the show ever. She just like understands it. She gets it. Yeah. It's so weird how they like got their phones out and were like filming themselves. At. Like they just had this big argument and they immediately went. <laughs> I feel myself walking back. <laughs> the parents really changed. They've become better. I don't, I, I'll actually, I thought the parents were very overbearing. But I mean, it's obvious in the relationship with Brandon. But at the same time, I always kind of liked the parents, honestly. I mean, it's almost like. They have to be like that because Brandon yeah, can't yeah, it's do like, anything. The more you learn about Brandon, the more you're like, ah. <laughs> That's why your dad says, hey, yeah. this is what you're going to do. It's like, we need to get her on birth control, Brandon, because we know you ain't going <laughs> to. <laughs> All you do is brag about your pullout game. <laughs> <laughs> but then we come to the last clip. Brandon and Julia are married. What? Ta-da. Oh, no. That's right. We went, we went from those clips to... They're getting married. Oh, no. They got all the freaking everyone's phones ever is set up here. <laughs> all right. Let's, let's see. The, let's, let's is, see. She, is she smiling? I'm sure she is. You know, it's her wedding day. She wants the relationship to work out. I she does. I feel like they both want the relationship <laughs> to work out. I think they just need a... All right. For all of you that are watching at home that aren't married yet... I mean, let me give you some, some dad advice. <laughs> a big part of growing up in the world and getting married and having kids is becoming less selfish. That's kind of the whole thing that makes it work, is not focusing so much on yourself as you do on other people. Now, it's still important to take time for yourself, but you just have to give a little bit of that away. This whole process is like watching Brandon learn that the hard way. Yeah, I, I just, I don't know, I, just, I feel like I can understand where this is going on. It just pains me so much that I feel like Brandon can't see it and everyone else can. Uh, yeah, like, I just hope that he shows that he cares about something other than himself, at least starting from this day after or something, you and know, like, I don't know. The thing about it is that, he, I don't know, Brandon even watched this video. At this time, that doesn't make sense to him. Like, it's like, he... he He's like, I am being selfless. What are you talking about? I brought her over here to where I live and made her raise my animals and, you know, <laughs> live in my parents' house. It was all for her. Yeah. <laughs> you know. Yeah. Oh, the convenience for According to you? Brandon, right. Brandon yeah. it's all for, for her. Right. Anyway, it's life lesson with Ken. There you go. <laughs> Please take this ring. Mm -hmm. And as you place it on Julia's finger, mm -hmm. take your pledge to her by repeating these words. 
I, Brandon, take you, Yulia, to be. <laughs> this, dude, this dude is just like standing. Up. <laughs> I just had to pause it there because Brandon went mm -hmm, about like eighteen times. Like mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm, and then this dude in the back right here is just like no. <laughs> I, Yulia, take you, Brandon, to be my husband. I, Yulia, take you, Brandon, to be my husband. I give you this ring. Is that the happy smirk she's got on right now, or is that kind of like that? Mm, got him. <laughs> uh, she's probably shocked as we are that he showed up. <laughs> <laughs> he remembered the day and where it was at. You know oh, what I mean? Yeah. Like, it's like her, that's her favorite number, I think, or something. Like <laughs> oh man, what you wearing that white dress for? Oh, today! Oh, with all that I have. Mom and dad I watching here. With yeah. all that I have. For She's got, like, she got some titty shoes on, the dress on. Shoes. She's looking so she sporty some, right now. She got some Jordans, yo. Oh, man, she, she's got the Jordans <laughs> on just in case she got up there and she needed to run. <laughs> <laughs> she's going to catch Brandon. You may run out the day, Brandon, not on her day. She's coming for you. And Brandon, you may kiss your bride. No! <laughs> like, 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 they're sitting there kissing and he gives her, like, the, uh, the excited, like, shake here. Like, he's like... Yay! Hooray! <laughs> Yay! Woo! We're so excited! Yay! <laughs> it feels amazing. I've never been happier. Oh, mom's crying! Yeah! Other mom's crying! Hooray! Hey, there we go. Brandon's never been happy. <laughs> never. Look at the joy. He's, he's looking at mom like, thanks for letting me know, mom, for reminding me of today. Like, I mean, they, they had to have a very simple wedding, right? Like. All she wanted from Brandon was just a little excitement. That's just, it. Just, just to be happy. That's just to be excited about it. Yep. Like, come in and, you know, wear your polka dot shirt, you know, and be proud of it. You know, you know like, he'd even wipe the dust off the shoulder right there. <laughs> it was so sad having the ceremony to an empty church, but you know what? We were there and Pop Pop was there. So this was just the oh. warm up to the full. That's all Pop Pop. Yeah. yeah. Pop Pop. Pop Pop. Yeah, he's like, dang, girl, what up? You know? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, dang. <laughs> Did you dang my grass? <laughs> Brandon. Oh, my. I didn't think you had it in you, son. <laughs> it's, it's, it's so wholesome because dad's in the background. Pop was there. Dad's in the background. He's got like two, two cameras, <laughs> you know? <laughs> Yeah, there's phones everywhere. So this is just the warm up to the full church one day down the road. I think so. <laughs> I think so. I think so. I think so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think so. I think so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Who are supposedly? If we leave it up to Brandon, probably not. <laughs> uh... Wait, what? He's going here. He's 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 hugging Pop Pop here, and he's saying, "Do I do I know you?" <laughs> Pop pop, pop pop. It's Brandon. Come on, man. <laughs> He's still staring at Julia. <laughs> Are you happy that your grandson found a pretty wife? Who wouldn't be? Oh yeah. I often thought about finding girls for him, but he didn't need to do anything for him because he did it on his own. <laughs> oh pop pop the pill. Oh pop pop was like, hey, look, Brandon, I could have hooked him up. You know, I got him lined up. I'm so proud he finally did something on his own. <laughs> what a sweet old man. He's like, oh yeah, he finally. Oh, <laughs> oh, Brandon! <laughs> I'm gonna hook him up, you know. <laughs> Went and found him a real keeper. I guess my father like keep him more to like be man, but him like this is like sad moment, like happy sad moment. Yeah, this is a happy sad moment for all of us. We're like they got yeah. married, but we're like uh, oh, but the Brandon. Maybe he can, that's how Dad feels. Maybe Brandon can get it figured out. I don't know. <laughs> uh. The, the the after after ninety days episodes of Brandon and Julia are gonna be interesting. I think they, <sighs> they got married. Let me see. What, I gotta see what the top comment is. What is it? I just hope she doesn't regret marrying him. We are talking about a guy who can't even think for himself. He had to tell his parents about the pregnancy scare before getting a test first. And if that wasn't between them to begin with, but that grandpa should star in a movie. Heck yeah, he yeah, should. He should. <laughs> <laughs> the best movie we've seen so far. <laughs> and I, I hope it works out well for him. I, I hope uh. they they're able to. You know, maybe the show just over dramatized the whole issues they had, you know, for television. Maybe everything's much greater oh, off camera. Yeah, yeah uh, maybe. Or worse. Or, <laughs> or worse. <laughs> you know. Maybe they can only capture so much of Brandon's <laughs> fail. Maybe, maybe you can only put so much of Brandon's fail on TV. Well, anyway, let us know what you think down <laughs> in the comments below. I hope you enjoyed this episode uh, and this whole the whole saga of Brandon and Julie. I'm glad we picked them out out of all the families. Yes, you know? this was my favorite. Oh. But anyway, if today's your birthday, happy birthday. Uh, stay toasty, my friends. And I love you. I'm scared.